Hey guys, what is up? Welcome to Happy Holidays on my channel. I am joined by Jenna today because I am home because it is Thanksgiving break and Thanksgiving means Black Friday, which means Black Friday haul for you. Anyway, let's get started. We are going to start with Walmart. Now, I went to Walmart twice on Black Friday. Um, one of the things I got at Walmart were these brushes. Um, we'll get into why I got these later, but I got brushes. I also attacked the movies. Um, far warning, if you're watching this and you're one of like my friends or family back home, some of these might be for you. So spoiler alert. So look away. I don't know. Okay. So I got um, all of the movies that I have that I have the green promo at the top, I got for $2. So um, I got Flight for my dad, The Heat for my dad, I already have it, so I know he wants his own copy. Um, Taken 2, After Earth, and Pain and Gain, I all got for my dad. Um, for my, I do a lot of Black Friday shopping for myself, so... Um, I got a combo pack of The Interview and This Is The End. I think this was $4 because it's a yellow one, so I think it was like $4. Um, I got the Moral, Mortal Instrument City of Bones. Um, I saw this in movie theaters and I've never read any of the books, so yell at me if you must. But uh, I saw this movie and it was so kick-ass. So I finally saw it and I got it for five bucks and I was like, haha, mine. Back down to the $2 movies. I got The Internship, The Conjuring, Percy Jackson's Sea Monsters, The Other Woman, which is an amazing movie. It was in one of my favorites a few, like whenever I was doing favorites in the beginning of the summer. So check this out if you haven't already. Um, the Cranks and The Holiday. The Holiday is such a great um, and then I got Walking with the Dinosaurs because it's just a cute movie. And that is what I got at Walmart. Let's go to the next place. So next we will go to Target. Now, I have a lot from Target. To make a long story short, I went to Target four times on Black Friday. Um, yeah. If you want to hear some of my Black Friday stories, leave it down in the comments and maybe I'll do some story times with Black Friday. But let's get in to what I got at Target. I got these paper straws that say cheers on it for a dollar. I mean, super cute. I got a little polar bear stuffed animal for for someone who's over there chewing real loud. One dollar. Shh. I ended up getting these paper flags for a dollar. They were uber cute. I just, I don't know, stationary. I mean, come on. I got some movies while I was there. I got 22 Jump Street on Blu-ray, which I think was like four or six bucks. Um, I got American Sniper, which I believe was four dollars from my pops, because he said he really wanted it, so I got it. I got Paddington, which I believe was four dollars. I haven't seen it yet, but I heard that it's one of those movies that I would absolutely enjoy, so I got it for myself. And then I got Fault in Our Stars. Now, I have torn feelings about this movie. I absolutely love it, but I don't want to love it. So I bought it for myself because it was like four to six bucks. I don't remember, but I got it. I also got this <laughs> tube of ornaments for a dollar. They're like plastic and glittery and just adorable. So you'll see what they're for in a second. So I found this little Christmas tree for $3 at Target. Um, and for a lot of my holiday videos, I want to have it in my background, and it was literally $3, guys. It just needs some tender love and care, but, um, I thought it'd be super cute, so I got the little ornaments to put on my little tree. You know, why not? I also got more movies at Target. I got That Awkward Moment and Rise of the Guardians. I haven't seen this one yet. I hear it's very good. Rise of the Guardians is one of the best movies in the entire planet, and I might already own it, but I'm not really sure, and I couldn't take the risk, because these were like four bucks each or something like that, and I was not going to risk that. You can't risk it. Next, I got Between Us by One Direction. It's their newest perfume. 
let me just tell you how amazing this smells. Um, I bought like a super tiny, it's a one fluid ounce um, container, so it's a really tiny one. Um, I can take it out for you guys because I've already opened it because I had to wear it today. Jenna, um, because it smells so good. Um, but it's this cute little perfume bottle and it has this little thing that says One Direction on it. And literally, this is my favorite out of all of them. Like, the only one I don't own at this point is You and I, but um, I've smelt it before, and it's still not as good as this one. Like, this is literally my favorite. Like, I want a huge bottle of it, but it literally costs, like, a gazillion dollars. But, yes. Just yes. Next, I got this uh, Gingerbread Village kit. Um, you will be seeing this again in the near future, but I got this for like 10 bucks, which was awesome. So yeah, yeah, Target. I got these $3 socks. They're like super like spandexy, and they're just uber cute and I just wanted them on my feet. So I got them because I just love them. I got more paper straws. These have little Christmas trees on them. I thought they were uber, uber cute. Um, they were a dollar, so I got them. The last thing from Target is this little chalkboard easel. Um, it even comes with like a little piece of chalk, which is uber cute. Um, but it's black and red, which like matches my room and everything. Um, and I thought it'd be super cute just to put like little messages on it or like I can literally do this, like so many different things with it. And it was only $3. So I mean, come on, $3 for this. It's uber cute. Duh. Alright, so that concludes Target, so let's move on to Old Navy. So, I haven't actually physically gone to Old Navy and shopped in a really long time, but, I mean, the whole store was like 50% off. But, um, I got these socks that have these little elephants on them. They're so cute. Um, I know someone who really likes elephants, so they're getting elephant socks for Christmas. I don't know who that could be. I also got these which have these like the tribal-y kind of design on them. I don't know. They're uber cute and I wanted them on my feet so I got them. I also got this these fox socks. They have like little foxes and like trees and birds on them um, and I'm honestly obsessed. I used to watch a YouTuber who strictly did Sims videos and she had uh, her name was Copper Fox, I believe, and um, she so she had foxes all over the place. And ever since she, like well, I watched her videos, like I'm just obsessed with so uh, foxes all of a sudden. So yeah, I just really like foxes now. But yeah, I also got these wiener dog socks because it's a wiener dog, and the wiener dog has a sweater. I mean, is there is there any question? I don't know. Just there is no question. All of those socks were $2 originally. They were 50% off. I got them for a dollar. One dollar socks. What? The next thing I got was from Clearance, so it wasn't 50% off, which was kind of like, whatever. But I got this really, like, big, it's like a big top. And um, it's like probably quarter, quarter, uh, leave, quarter, three quarters length sleeves. Words are a thing. And it's got this like weird triangle cut out, but I thought it was kind of cute. And it's like, it's soft and light and just like would be awesome with leggings. And it was $4.99. The last thing I got from Old Navy is this like, na like dark navy blue. It's pretty much the same style where it's just super big and like wide and stuff. And it's got this cute little booby pocket. Um, and I ended up getting this for $10 and it was originally $25. So I got $15 off this and it's literally one of the softest things I've ever touched in my entire life. Like it's so soft guys. I love it. The next we'll go to Best Buy. Um, I got more movies, shock, shock, surprise. If you knew what my movie collection looked like, you would understand. Um, I got Prometheus for my dad. I think it was like two bucks. Let's see. Um, yeah. Yeah. 
this was two dollars I got Goodwill Hunting, which is a total classic, for $2. I got Cinderella, which um, is the new Cinderella, and I haven't actually seen it, and I'm so excited to watch this. And this was $10. And then I got the new Despicable Me, which is Blu-ray, DVD, and digital copy for 5 bucks. I wasn't a fan of Despicable Me 2, but, I mean, you gotta get it, right? Right? Alright. So, 5 bucks for this winner. 